TFGM had drawn up a list, a priority list, where Walkden was the number one priority in Greater Manchester. So we were hopeful that the next round of access for all funding, when it was announced, we would be successful, as we were already listed as the number one priority. Uh, but in fact, uh, we were not chosen, and only two stations in Greater Manchester were funded uh, in the next round, which are Earlham and Daisy Hill, and Walkden wasn't successful, which um, was a, what came as a, a very dis big surprise and a big disappointment to us. So many of the stations around Greater Manchester are still uh, inaccessible to, to people, but not only disabled people, but people with prams, and push chairs, and large amounts of luggage. I've got 50 odd stairs to get up here and it's, it's just impossible for, for many people to access the station. In our view, one of the main problems is that there is only one funding pot at the moment, which is a central government controlled funding pot, the Access for All funding, which only comes around every five years. So we're pressing the point that there should be a different uh, pot of money allocated to schemes like this and perhaps uh, with increasing devolution, which um, seems to be favoured politically at the moment, that as part of that process, a different method of funding access for all type projects in Greater Manchester um, and therefore in Salford um, would be um, would be needed uh, and that's one of the things that we're, we're the message we're trying to put out um, and, um, and hopefully if that comes to fruition and, there, and a different source of funding is found we would have a very strong case moving forward uh, rather than having to wait another five years which is just unacceptable.